It's been one year since the coronavirus started to spread rapidly across Europe. And apart from all the difficulties and sorrow it brought to our personal lives, it also made it necessary for us, as Charter of European Rural Communities, to take the decision to postpone the meetings which were scheduled to take place in 2020. At that time, we hoped that this year would be a much better year for the world and for our network. Unfortunately, we have to come to the conclusion that the situation is not much better as it was last year. Although all European countries have started their vaccination programs in the meanwhile, we are still facing government measures, travel restrictions and even new lockdowns. Since December, the Presidium Youth Coordination Team and project owners have gathered in several digital meetings and we took the decision to come up with some scenarios for the Charter to see what 2021 could look like. The scenarios went from doing everything as planned to cancelling all meetings. And we also decided that by the end of February, we would take our first decision on the agenda of this year. And that's why I'm sending this video message to you. As you all know, the core principle of our network is our friendship. People meet people is our motto, and we always say that the best way to do it is at each other's kitchen table, by staying in host families. Also, our top priority is the safety and health of our participants and hosts. The current situation throughout Europe makes it very difficult to combine those two. And therefore, we had to take the unfortunate decision again that it's not possible to have the meetings as we want them to, and therefore we had to postpone several meetings again. It concerns the small meeting in Ash, the Netherlands, the youth meeting in Cashel, Ireland, the annual meeting in Bienvenida, Spain, and the closure conference for our youngsters, which was scheduled to take place in Oppenburg, Sweden. Those four meetings will not take place on the moments as communicated to you before, but will be rescheduled to a later time. I can tell you this was not an easy decision, but both the Presidium and the Youth Coordination Team think this is the only right decision to take right now. We also took the decision to increase the digital presence of the Charter. The upcoming weeks and months, whilst we are rescheduling the agenda of our meetings, the Youth Coordination Team, Project Owners and Web and Social Media Team will create certain digital activities on our social media. And as soon as there's more information, we will of course share it with you so you can participate. And I can tell you that the first ideas look very promising, so stay tuned. Dear friends, I had hoped to be able to share better news with you. But although the past year has been a tough one, the value of our network has been proven by the digital activities, your involvement and the messages sent across Europe. I hope to be able to see all of you very soon again. And in the meanwhile, stay safe and stay healthy.